Rounding and estimating to one significant figure. Round to one significant figure. Now, with one sig fig, what we're doing here is looking for the first important digit. So the first important digit in any number is the leftmost number that isn't a zero. So in this case, that's this three. And then we think to ourselves, that's three hundred. So we need to round it to the nearest hundred. So 304.2 to the nearest hundred is 300. 18.97 is the first significant figure, the 1, but that 1 represents 10, so we need to write to the nearest 10, and 18.97 to the nearest 10 is 20. 2.47, that's the first digit is a units digit, so we've got to write to the nearest whole number, which is just going to be 2, and here we ignore the 0, and we go to the first non-zero, which is this 3, it's 3 tenths, so we write to the nearest tenth, which is going to be 0.4. So estimating to one, whilst rounding to one significant figure. Now any rough calculation of estimation should be done to one significant figure. That's all you really need to get an idea of the answer. Um, but quite often people are tempted to do things more accurately. There's no need for it. So when we're looking at this number 19, we really should just call it 20. And this number 1.73 to one significant figure to the to the nearest whole number is 2. So that's approximately 40. No need to be any more accurate than that. 98.1, this is the first digit is a 10, so the nearest 10 that's 100. 41.8, so the nearest 10 is 40, and 100 times 40 is 4000. Now it's quite tempting to maybe put 42 there in times by 100, 42, uh, 4200. There's no need for that, but I think in the old in in the past you would have been penalized for actually being more accurate but nowadays they tend to give you um, an answer in a range that, that's around the actual sort of estimated answer so you'd probably be okay if you did a little bit of a uh, extra detail there um, 73.8 to the nearest uh, one significant figure so that's 70 because to the nearest 10 divided by the nearest, nearest whole number is 5, and 5 is going to 70 14 times. Okay, when you've got a fraction line, you've got to remember that that means that this whole, the top, is in a imaginary bracket, so we must do the top and the bottom separately, and then do the division. So, we start with 80 plus 20, and we're going to divide by 10. So that's 100 divided by 10, which is just 10. OK, these should be squiggly equals as well. So this one we've got 4 times 6 all over 3 plus 5. 4 times 6 is 24, over 3 plus 5 is 8. So the answer to that would be approximately 3. And then we'd have 20 times 40 over 0.2. 20 times 40 is 800, two fours are eight, two zeros, divided by 0 0.2. Two ways of doing that, you could have a think about just dividing two into eight to get four, and then realizing that because it's 0.2, it's gonna be 10 times bigger, so it's gonna be 4,000. Or you could realize that 0 0.2 goes into one five times, and therefore it will go into 800 five times, 800 times. Either way, the answer is 4,000, so it's approximately 4,000. OK, now some for you to try do. Um, pause the video and have a go at these. OK, rounding, one significant figure. To nearest, and this one's nearest 100, so that's 900. This one's to the nearest 10, which is 10. This one's to the nearest unit, which is 5. And this one's to the nearest hundredth, which is going to be 0 0.03. Estimating these, we're going to do 20 times 3 which is 60. 167 is going to be roughly 200 times 2 would be 400. 63.8 to the nearest 10 is 60 divided by 3 which is 20. And then we've got uh, 10, no sorry not 10, 20 plus 70 over 10 so that's 90 over 10 which is 9 approximately. And then we've got 
20 times by 4 over 9 minus 4 which is 5 so we've got 80 over 5 which is going to be 16 and the last one we've got 40 times by 50 all over 0 0.5 so that's 4 5 is 20, 2 0 is 2000 over 0 0.5 again we can, we can do uh, 2000 divided by 5 and then times the answer by 10 um, or we could realise because it's divided by 0 0.5 we're just going to double it because 0 0.5 goes into everything twi uh, twice as much as 1 does so the answer is going to be 4000 approximately there we go